So imagine you're in charge of a mega bee colony with a bunch of military weapons. And pretty much every six minutes, hornets come trying to punch my face off, but that's fine. That's why we have these research centers to build our defenses. And people also let me know that if I were to get upgrade into this small fountain and palm path, that I get something fun. So I'm gonna queue that research up. And as you can see, I'm only at 359 out of 500 tiles for my hive capacity. I might as well get some more structures out here. Making honeycomb tiles is extremely easy. It takes like two wax. Wax was the very first resource that I had. As you can see, these little Hello. builder bee guys just kind of carry their buckets over. And now for you, buddy, let's get a rocket launcher down and then a bolt shooter, another rocket launcher, another rocket launcher. You know what? It's all explosives all the time. It's all rocket launchers, baby. It's going to be like the 4th of July, the moment any bee shows up. Ooh, also my research center's done. Going to Palm. Wait, Professor improves my scientist skill? My research time gets shorter? I should have done this years ago. Also, I got a lot of suggestions last time that I can make more kindergartens. The education of youth is vitally important to the success of a nation. I should have known the whole time. Honey storage! Oh, I need that immediately. That would speed up so many things. But so if I make another kindergarten there, squeeze a couple more in here. Kindergartens are what grow my normal bees that go out and collect a bunch of resources. They can also grow like builders and soldiers, but I pretty much want these resource collectors because there's a chilling man right next to my glowing god source. What more could I need? Also, look at just how expansive this is. Oh my gosh. I wouldn't want to raid this. Wait, we're about to be attacked. Sound the alarm. All bees, return to the queen. Here comes wave 11 of these jerks. Oh, I see one. Well, I've got this agitation button, which is going to take over five wasps, but oh my gosh, look at all the rockets going. This is insane. Take over one of the rockets. There seems to be a big old group of enemies right here. Fire, fire, fire. This is good. I got a bunch of anti-air guns that are kind of going. We are decimating these ladybugs. Oh my gosh, dude. I didn't realize I trained all my soldier bees so well too. Oh, and these are my helpful little hornets. You can tell because of the way they are. Now we've got three big ladybugs coming in. These jerks drop structures that like break my base. I pretty much want them dead uh, immediately, all the time, as fast as I possibly can. Thankfully, my anti-air guns and constant barrage of pain and suffering that I cause seems to work out pretty well for that. We got them. Yep, that's Oh, sweet success. All right, unsound the alarm. Everyone get back to work. I almost feel like my rocket launchers aren't super accurate. So it's good to have arrow shooters every once in a while. However, I do feel like my ballistas suck. So what I can do is make more honeycomb structures like this, where my ballistas were. And then I'll be able to just replace them with anti-air missiles, which uh much, much stronger. However, my research factory did just finish up honey storage. And as far as my research goes, I think trying to get my military stuff maxed out, I get military benefits and there's a howitzer. Maybe I want that too. Oh, looks like we finished up one of these kindergartens though. I want to try and make a bunch more producer bees, put 50 into there. That would be like 105, some more builders, soldiers are looking somewhat solid. Also need to mark some miscellaneous tiles for honey storage now that I have it. And look, my decorations gave me a palm tree in this tiny fountain. Make a couple more soldier bees and queue up a couple more builder bees. I can also make some medic bees, that's right. I forgot I built the Cybertron Hospital. So while I let my bees grow and develop in their beautiful kindergartens that are tax funded the bees have taxes. I'm kind of laying the future groundwork for some of my bases because my hive capacity is getting a little bit close to the max, but that's probably fine. Oh, my binoculars are done too. Let's go Peaky Blinders next. <laughs> By order of the Peaky Blinders, in it. Anyways, that'll get my soldier bees to 20% more damage and wow, that is okay. That's just an excessive display of force. I mean, I, I guess this is good though, right? Very unfortunate that some dragonflies are able to get through, but I also- No! My tiles! Anti-air guns. Look at this ladybug instead. You, you know what? I'll do it myself. Ladybug dropped. Oh, those are my bee friends. I'm just shooting from downtown, but I feel like it's working too. It's these stupid bombing dragonflies that really just ruin everything for me. How's our damage looking on the perimeter? Couple structures lost there. On the hive base itself, it seems like we're fine. And look at- Oh my gosh, look at my army just going in. Guys, you're not fast enough. You have to make sure you catch the ladybug. Here, try again. Just start crashing into him. Nope. Yeah, okay. Get him in the butt. Get him in the butt. There you go. Everyone's weak to the butt. I forgot to sound the alarm right there, but it's fine. I, I don't know if I lost any bees, actually. So my research facility is done with Peaky Blinders. Let's go ahead and go into my howitzer unlock. Add on a couple more hive pieces here. Everyone placing that nice and neat. Thank you. My scouts have noticed that the hornets have tuned up with moths? What? Why? That's fine. 
More anti-aircraft guns. Anti-aircraft guns, some rocket launchers. Just more defense is all about. I kind of wish I could like pause time and remodel everything about my base, but time stopping is a luxury for wizards and that one purple alien guy from Dragon Ball. So instead, I'll just go with what I must. Also trying to make some more wax factories here. An ambrosia factory or two. Another hardened wax factory, also probably nice. So that probably helps. Oh, my howitzer's done. Okay, let's go with hardened wax storage because I I think that'll be handy. Where's my howitzer at? What's it look like? Oh, it's also one of these little things. That's fine. Put one right there. Try and find another little spot. Like right there can work. I essentially want like a howitzer in every part of my map. Why you ask? Cause it's cool. <laughs> what other reason do I need? See, I'm almost at half my beat capacity too. Did I research anything else? Okay, yeah, hard way. But I'm almost at my maximum hive capacity. Oh no. Maybe I'll just make a little segment here to max it out. Now we're at 500 out of 500 when this is done. Look at everyone working so diligently. They trust me with their lives. Their frail, technically meaningless lives. Wow. Oh, another research facility is done. Population growth would be huge. Go into researching royal food then, so I can try and get that. And now we queue up the howitzers, which the range on these things is gigantic. Borderline feel bad for anything that actually tries to come get me. Sound the alarm. We're fighting. I didn't even get a finished howitzer production. It's okay though, we're good. Wave 13 is in. These dragonfly jerks really do just get through all my defenses, huh? It's like they fly too quick for my things to keep up, which as you can imagine, super annoying. So now I've yet to see a moth come from anywhere. It's just still more gunpowder dragonflies, which they've destroyed at least 15 of my structures since I was at the max before. <laughs> you jerks. Oh yeah, I just took out this entire row in here and I'm bad at keeping track of what storages I'm missing. So I hope they weren't that important. We're good. That was okay. I didn't see a single moth that entire time. Whatever. I guess it doesn't matter though, since I continue to win. Also, I realized because all my defenses are on the outside that they might not register inside my base so I should smack a couple more on the inside and hopefully that'll help also I've got a big old ballista right here delete we're gonna find something new for you to go buddy in my research center of royal foods done we can start my population growth which is just six honey I had a bunch of honey storages do I still have them I hope maybe I don't really know what I'm waiting on too but I just still don't have a howitzer yet it looks like everything's in there hopefully I can at least have one in like the next wave oh and my population growth is going yes I'm gonna hopefully try and max out all of these things and then by wave 15, I'll be able to enter my new era. The era of howitzers and killing things. I'm also pretty confident what's been slowing it down is the fact that I keep placing rocket launches everywhere, which take hardened wax, which is, you know, kind of the most valuable resource I have. But I think all my outer defenses are kind of set now. Oh, I didn't realize we were about to get raided. Start the alarm again. There's one hornet over here. How are we all missing? There we go. Wait, that was the wave? The wave was just one little baby hornet? I'll accept that. Yep, everyone back to work now. Go. Oh, and I got my little agitation thing back. Sweet. Oh, my research is done. Let's go to big storage. Is it going to make my storages automatically get better? That would be nice if so. Oh, I see them putting hardened wax on one of my giant howitzers. Oh, wait, one's done right here. Oh, this thing looks cool. Oh my gosh. This is just so sick. It also fires insanely quick. Oh, Oh yeah, all my defenses are basically done around the base. Well, let's try and get foreman then. It'll increase my building speed for any future projects and repairs I need. And also sound the alarm because the next wave's coming. Where it's coming from though, can tell you. Oh, that is most definitely a moth right there. Give me control of my howitzer. Is that moth a bomber? Wait, what? That looks so crazy. Shoot him down. Shoot him down. Don't let him do a bunch of damage. Okay, they are bombing the crap out of everything. No, they got one of my wax factories. <laughs> Maws are just so intense. They're like camping almost. I am rapidly losing structures. It's because none of my guys can aim properly to hit these stupid dragonflies. And why is everyone faster than my soldier bees? It borderline does not feel fair. Those howitzers were insane though. Also have enough stuff. I can put this park down. That is just glistening. Look at how pretty. And let's start new commander. This gives me more soldier bees. I can get another hardened wax factory down there. And now I've got a real simple system called a uh, spam rocket launchers on every tile that these guys have broken in a cruel desperate attempt in revenge it wasn't a rocket launcher thing there before they broke it they should have just left it alone and my new commander is about to be done start my military benefits you guys want free college well that's kind of a must how else am i going to get you into my military it looks like all my outside guns though are doing okay i do just need a crap ton of hardened wax i think i only have like two factories for it but it'll hopefully be fine oh my military benefits are about to be done too 
that's just going to my new era where there's mini guns. I want the mini guns as fast as I can. Morph! Get me on the anti-air gun. I gotta immediately start devoting to blasting this guy. He's just got so much HP, I feel like. Oh no, there was another one. I feel like I can only watch in horror as he just bombards everything around my base. It's cruel and it hurts. Why, Malz? What did I ever do to you? Look at how many structures I'm just missing now. It's truthfully hard for me to even know what's gone and what's not. I apparently lost 37 of my bees. My queen still seems to be doing fine though. Are you just like reading the image for the game? Okay. Well, my elite regime's about to be done. I need to immediately try and click minigun. Auto-guided missiles? This is most definitely what I need. Go. Go research as fast as possible. Which minigun's done? Yes. Anti-aircraft system. Go. The minigun is the same size as a howitzer. Man, that is resource intensive. But if it gets the job done, I'm not gonna scoff at it. Just keep trying to demo everything team i feel like wave 17 we've had a much better defense than last time that might just be me being hopeful though too <laughs> While all that fighting's going on, I'm also dropping my other military bunker. I'm gonna make this weird Spider-Man-like structure for my second military bunker here. I also wanna try and get a couple more honeycombs down and around, like so. Cause then I can start the preparations for miniguns. My next wave is in three and a half minutes though. Don't know if I'm gonna have enough time, but also we can start getting military bunker three down too. Oh wait, my minigun's here. Oh, whoa, oh my, okay, oh God, oh. Oh, this is, oh, that's something special. Look at all the casings, those are all shells. The next wave commences. I forgot to do my radar, but now that I've got my minigun going, just drop him. Just gotta keep blasting around at everyone. These stupid malls. Why do they have so much HP? It's really annoying. I hate them. I hate you all. Every single one of you is the bane of my existence. Just keep minigun blasting. My research center's done too. Start getting academic to abidame edition. Oh, wow, they just do so much damage all the time. Everything hurts. But with my unlocks of miniguns, I'm starting to feel a lot better about my odds of getting through all of this. And next time I get a new howitzer sting. Oh, I can't wait.